Today, I am doing the first ever Zoom interview fireside chat. This is a big step, and I'm very honored to begin this interview with two wonderful gentlemen. The primary guest today is Alexei Grachev from St. Petersburg, Russia, the president of St. Petersburg Leatherman. Assisting us today is Mike Est of Estonia, who is the president of Leatherman Club Estonia. Mike is being very gracious to assist us with Russian and English translation, because my Russian is maybe two words or three words only. So Alexei, I must apologize for that. So. <laughs> So I will begin right now. Alexei, please tell me about your early life and your family. Uh, no. Uh, my uh, 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 my childhood was quite uh, ordinary as uh, uh, other uh, young people in in Russia. Uh, I I studied in a special school uh, for children who has problem with hearing, but uh, after finishing this school, I studied in ordinary school as uh, ordinary children. Uh, I was the first one who uh, uh, come to the ordinary uh, school with problem uh, uh, with hearing. Uh, so uh, I was the first. There wasn't such kind of children before. Uh, if if I graduated uh, uh, from uh, the secondary school. Uh, uh, I, I went to the in institute, uh, to the, uh, to the uh, high, uh, higher school. I have two, uh, uh, two uh, uh, diplomas. Uh, I have a, cer a certified um, uh, pharmaceut and uh, also uh, 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 business uh, businessman uh, uh, business administration please tell me a little bit about your life in the communist system Mostly, the study is, uh, uh, was fulfilling my life uh, this time, but of course I was interested about uh, guys, but uh, I didn't uh, recognize my interest uh, in this time so well. If if I was 15 years old, I um, uh, uh, ch uh, chatted with my friends in in school and so on, but not, nothing specially. Uh, with time, I I started to understood. Uh, about my interest, but of course, uh, uh, nobody uh, could uh, know it. It was uh, in deep secret. Uh, he he need to keep uh, a polite position because his stepfather was a vice uh, major of the Saint Petersburg this time, uh. and therefore he need to keep such 
polite and prestige position and and uh, the position of of his family too. Uh, and uh, he married uh, when he was uh, 21 uh, years old and now he already has daughter who he uh, she is 25 uh, she knows uh, uh, orientation of uh, him and support uh, uh, Alexei with uh, any situation but did you feel at age 21 that you must marry a woman yes it's just my need to put a new notion of the sun no rancho peri takia kapas karat panyatia yes it am a start a new talk sim here group now партийного работника. То есть наши там уже могут быть очень большие вопросы и проблемы с карьерой. Почему? Понятно. Uh, situation was so that in this time it, it was um, uh, common that people uh, must marry and if they don't, uh, then it, it, it looked looked strange and if you like to make a career uh, you need to have a, a family and children and all kinds of stuff then then you could have a, a better position in uh, in uh, in your career therefore it was necessary uh -huh. yeah yeah so, so society uh, needs is that uh, you are correct and uh, ordinary uh, member of the society. Yeah. How long were you married? Сколько лет был женат? Семь лет. Seven years. Oh, okay. How did you come out as a gay man? Прежде всего она то сказала, что как там постепенно coming out. У меня как такового не было, но я как бы посередине и не скрываю, и не ищу об этом. Но, ну как, понял, да? Ну, середина, середина такая, не туда, не туда, ну так. I am, um, uh, make my coming out this way that uh, I didn't uh, uh, pronounce it uh, loudly, uh, but I didn't uh, uh, do it uh, secret too. It it, uh, it it it's this way. Uh, if 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 I got uh, 35 years old, uh, then I started more uh, think and busy with gay topics. Before uh, I had free companies, I had a lot of works, so I had hadn't too much time uh, for my personal life and also I thought that maybe it's not um, normal uh, to live uh, like quite a gay life this time. So after when I got uh, 35 then I had more time uh, to think about uh, it and to act more uh, oh likely uh, this time when i was uh, 35 uh, there uh, 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 started the first uh, uh, gay sites in the internet in russia where you could uh, have uh, relations and uh, uh, to know each other and therefore it was easier to communicate uh, uh, gay people in russia uh, 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 this time Please tell me more about that site. Uh, there was uh, different different ad advertising and a uh, 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 lot of uh, lot of uh, such kind of uh, advertising were 
uh, guys like to meet immediately and to have, have sex uh, the first time, but uh, I was more interested to know the other person more detailly understood which person he is. He uh, is he he's serious man or just some kind of uh, uh, such uh, person uh, who who like to have one 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 time fuck and that's all. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Was it very popular to use this site? Well, da, это было, пожалуй, ну, если не единственное, но по крайней мере доступность способ знакомства, помимо саун, бара, там пресса и так далее, но практически, практически, ну, вся Россия, вся Киев, Россия сидела в этой сайте знакомства. Mm -hmm. It it uh, it really was the first uh, chance to uh, uh, have a contact uh, in in Russia uh, for gay people because yeah. before there wasn't uh, uh, such kind of um, places uh, uh, and uh, it was it was uh, the first one and all Russia and all gay people in Russia could uh, use it. So it, it was very popular because there wasn't anything before. It, <laughs> it came with the internet. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, they, don't, they didn't have uh, such a magazine or, or printed uh, places where you could put uh, advertising. So internet uh, gave a chance to communicate directly to the gay people. How did you learn about homosexuality and about kink? Даже помню хорошо, что я в Википедии даже изучал, что означает слово «геи». Я один же знал, но мне просто хотелось понимать, что это такое. Я смотрел и делал ссылки в интернете. И потому что у меня был интерес, я смотрел about uh, these topics and uh, this way I could uh, collect some knowledge about uh, uh, these topics. So the internet was this uh, where I could uh, uh, educate myself on, on this field. Uh, 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 okay. For, for many of us in North America, and Europe also. We are very curious about gay life under communism. Please tell us a little bit about that. In, in the communist days of Russia, mm -hmm. how was their gay life? Were there bars or saunas or a cruising area? Mm -hmm. uh, this is very curious for us. Ну, учитывая то, что я достаточно поздно вошел к этой теме, но я прекрасно знал, что в Санкт-Петербурге были места для таких встреч. В Санкт-Петербурге есть старейшие и клуб Кабаре которые уже существовали давно в советских временах. Также есть а, так называемые плешки. Я не знаю, как ты сможешь перевести это место встреч геев практически на Невском проспекте, практически в центре Питера. Но об этом, конечно, знали только свои. Хорошо, я перевожу. Пер, перевожу. А, давай. Угу. Um... Uh, because I 
came out uh, so lately, I didn't participate too much uh, this time, but I knew that there are some um, uh, uh, bars and some places uh, where uh, gay uh, people could meet. And uh, uh, also uh, in the center of St. Petersburg on the, the main street, there was a, a, a place where um, gay people could meet. Of course, this information was known only in a gay circle, not uh, for everybody. But, but um, uh, in St. Petersburg, uh, there was already in Soviet time uh, one uh, cl uh, club which was uh, um, uh, well known for gay people and who gay people like to visit and to meet. O officially, of course, it wasn't gay club, but uh, people, people knew that they could uh, meet uh, other gay guys there uh, very often. Uh, of course, there wa uh, was uh, uh, such um, situations that uh, in uh, public saunas you could, uh, in certain time, uh, meet uh, gay guys. Mm -hmm. But uh, it was such uh, unofficially. And uh, 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 Alex uh, didn't visit it this um, uh, saunas and this cruising places this time, but uh, but uh, yes, there was um, uh, such places and uh, uh, people who who were in interested they could uh, visit them and to meet some other guys in this time. In uh, the Soviet times, uh, these gay people say. Uh, looked like uh, ordinary people and uh, uh, there wasn't uh, any different. But of course, if uh, some gays uh, were more um, differently outfit uh, or something uh, special, so, so then could be some, uh, how to say, uh, higher interest or uh, uh, the other, other guys could um, attack them then because they look looked like different and act different. But but uh, of course it it it, it wasn't uh, so uh, generally. But uh, but uh, with with some certain persons. So there there wasn't. Uh, there wasn't a big uh, danger for gay people if if you act like ordinary straight people so so nobody uh, was interested and uh, nobody uh, didn't care russia is depicted as having a negative view about homosexuality how do you see that in Russia today. Помимо того, что в свое время президент Ельцин убрал э, гомосексуализм из списка болезни, сейчас уже как бы ставится снова вопрос, чтобы mm -hmm. это все вернуть. Еще закон о пропаганде, который, right. я думаю, известен во всем мире, как таковой только осложняет все. Mm -hmm. Поэтому сейчас как бы те движения все больше уходят в подполье, несмотря на стремление активистов как-то решить эту проблему. Но пока mm -hmm. 
uh, sit, uh, situation in Russia uh, is going uh, more complicated uh, nowadays mm. because uh, uh, official authorities they found uh, in uh, gay movement uh, useful uh, enemy uh, who uh, uh, who who they need to attack to uh, 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 to orient it. Uh, people uh, uh, from real problem to such, um, uh, uh, how to say, um, moral problems, mm. uh, like uh, he, uh, like is a gay movement, and uh, uh, af after collapsing of a uh, communist system, uh, the first president uh, of Russia, uh, Yeltsin. He uh, uh, took from penal code uh, 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 homosexuality as a crime, oh. but now, uh, now uh, the authorities say are talking again that uh, we we need to put it back to the penal code. So um, uh, this way, uh, this um, uh, gay activist uh, who would like to organize and um, uh, develop the gay movement in Russia, they are going um, more deeply uh, under, uh, under the um, uh, uh, cover yeah. because, because uh, 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 authorities, they try to show that uh, it, it is uh, uh, not common for uh, Russia and not not uh, common for tradi traditional uh, uh, values. Uh -huh. Do you think authorities will succeed? российского менталитета, как бы, для которого правильным является только союз мужчины и женщины, mm -hmm. а другого для них уже неприемлемо. Тут, конечно, еще и включается сама церковь, ее э, подход к этому вопросу. Но я думаю, если обстановка, ну как бы сказать, понадобится правительству, то оно может сделать все, что угодно. Он думает, что сейчас нормальные Uh, to li liquidate uh, such um, uh, gay movement, of course they can do it, but uh, it's difficult to say because uh, Russia is so large and uh, of course the uh, uh, public opinion is a little bit different in uh, bigger cities and the small towns and countryside. So. We uh, we uh, we need to accept these differences too. How is the current gay life in Saint Petersburg? No, Saint Petersburg, of course, is gay life. But for the most part, I know there are three groups that work. One is the gay club, and one is the non-gay club. То отрывается, то закрывается, ну, по-разному. Mm -hmm. А да, ситуация много зависит. Вот. Uh, it's, there is a free uh, gay clubs uh, that 
uh, working nowadays in, in St. Petersburg. And uh, there is a cru cruising club uh, uh, which working in St. Petersburg too. Uh -huh. But uh, of course, uh, the life is uh, changing and uh, uh, the, uh, some clubs are uh, uh, have uh, openings and some uh, are closing. So the situation um, changing um, all time. You mentioned a cruising club. Is there a leather bar? Вороны, они практически очень закрытые у нас в Санкт-Петербурге. Практически они нигде не появляются. Если только на наши мероприятия, на мероприятия нашего кожаного клуба. Понятно. In the cruising club, there are mostly um, uh, vanilla guys, uh, leather and fetish uh, guys are very close in St. Petersburg and they didn't uh, show uh, yourself on uh, these clubs in leather gear. Uh, only, only this uh, uh, leather club uh, events there are uh, uh, guys in leather and they visiting not uh, and uh, other places in uh, in other clubs do you have private leather parties он спрашивает что вы организуете ли приватные вечеринки для для Yes, uh, they are organizing uh, 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 private uh, evenings. How, how does the community feel about this? Is it popular? Mm -hmm. uh, this event, uh, um, how to say, uh, it's uh, more, more popular than maybe some time ago, but uh, people are, how to say, very, um, very careful uh, and uh, uh, therefore uh, this interest is not so big it is bigger than it was uh, some times ago but not too much let's say say so uh, because uh, this is our uh, 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 leather club is not um, very large there is not too much members so we couldn't uh, rent a whole uh, 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 room. So uh, we need to accept that if we are organizing our meeting in some uh, club uh, rooms, then there will be in, uh, also other persons who are not members of our club and who are not into the festivities. They could be, of course, interested uh, about this and uh, but uh, they are not member of this club and uh, so uh, therefore uh, we don't organize uh, events only for fetish people. How about if you do this in a private home? Общие площадки, и мы практически не участвуем. Нет такого специального разделения для нас и для остальных. Просто нет. No, they don't organize events on private apartments or such places. They only use such public clubs and then they 
if, if it's, it's a large uh, uh, place and they have some room or corner where they are collecting for this event, then this way. Wow. How many people are part of the club? Uh -huh. uh, 15 uh, members. 50, five, zero. 15. 15. 15. 15. Oh, small. Это как бы примерная численность, а на самом деле, действительно, активно, ребят, наверное, человек всем больше. There is uh, 15 members, but uh, the active members uh, who participate and um, organizing in is uh, seven or eight in reality. Wow. That, that, that's a, a real, a real situation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, this is uh, this is of course not too much uh, people, uh, but uh, it, it's a, a reality of today, and a uh, lot of guys who are a little <laughs> bit interested about uh, leather and fetish, they are afraid that if the, uh, other persons could uh, know about their interest. They could have problem at work or with uh, family and so on. And therefore, they are keep uh, a low profile. Um, how is the scene elsewhere in Russia? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, in, in Moscow, in Moscow, the situation is a little bit better because it's a uh, capital and uh, the biggest center. Uh, there are more gay clubs and also the beer movement organizing uh, regular uh, sauna uh, uh, meetings uh, in Moscow. But uh, there, there are uh, uh, four free uh, cities where the gay activists try to organize something. But in smaller places, there is uh, nothing because uh, 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 it's, um, the public opinion is so that uh, it, 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 it's not, it, it is not uh, legal and uh, and uh, not supported. So uh, in in smaller places there is uh, no uh, any uh, such uh, events and meetings uh, as it uh, in in bigger in bigger places. And also uh, I forget um, uh, the influence uh, has uh, this uh, so-called. Uh, law against uh, homo propaganda for uh, minorities which uh, which uh, put uh, big pressure to gay uh, uh, activists because uh, it, it's forbidden to make gay propaganda for minorities in russia and therefore if there is something about gay life uh, uh, the authorities uh, also uh, uh, turning it against gay people that it, it's not prohibited to talk anything about gay uh, lifestyle and so on. 
even if, even 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 if uh, this uh, uh, for uh, 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 adult, adult people grown up people but uh, uh, this um, uh, authority say told that what well, uh, this uh, information could get for children uh, somehow and it's forbidden so uh, th that's a, a question and a problem um, uh, there is a fetish uh, club uh, in moscow uh, mm -hmm. who are interested in uh, latex and they are organizing once a year a competition mr uh, rubber russia oh. and and, uh, and uh, alex uh, uh, cooperating with them and they have connections but this is only once a year so yeah. there is no more regular events uh, during the year but once a year they are organizing uh, this competition uh, mr rubber russia uh -huh. uh, alex thinks that they has organized this uh, competition mr uh, uh, rubber russia three times three years uh, 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 uh. yeah Please tell us about being the president of St. Petersburg Leatherman. Yes, you are the Stavit Babot, the Yapadala, some Sibia Pastavit, Damusha, the Tokomo, Unica Nipolusha, Damusha, Lutheran Pelam, Tota, Katamo, Pisti, Savo, Edith, Pitoma, Silavia, no Capacara. Который не боится того, то он может а, открыться таким образом. Mm -hmm. Это неизбежно. Mm -hmm. Понятно. Я перевожу. Да, uh, uh, actually, uh, there wasn't any election for presidency in this club. Uh, they just uh, needed a person who was a leader, who yeah. could organize and who uh, other guys uh, trust and uh, go after him so mm -hmm. he um, elected uh, uh, himself president ah, uh, very good <laughs> so it, it, it was and uh, uh, the other point was also uh, that uh, 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 the president is somehow somehow public person and uh, uh, so uh, he he uh, he don't uh, afraid to be uh, looked as a, a leader of this uh, fetish and leather uh, movement. Uh, right. That was the other point where he was uh, agreed to take this uh, role and post. What would you do if you could be open about your kink? Пока до этого не дошло, но предпосылки для таких вот. Сейчас вечеринок уже типа накладывается. Ну, когда не буду, но такие приватные частные встречи, квартира, ну что-то в этом плане. Ну, посмотрим, надеюсь, получится. Uh, he, to, uh, he told that um, he, he is interest, interested in different kinks, but uh, uh, he, he hoped that he could practice them in some private uh, meetings in private uh, places. But he didn't uh, um, specialize uh, very much what, what kind of... Uh, think he'd like to practice himself Not... i i think what is what is the what is your favorite kink that you like to do well yeah what you do you mean to you know sami как говорится и сашно когда они подчинение но даже не знаю как сказать но, ну, короче, это минировать. Ну, я понимаю, конечно, не избивать, это потери сознания, ну, это понятно. Mm -hmm, понятно. Ну, вот так. 
Ну, когда вот собираешься, вот, да, компания пшел, ну, мне тут надо будет уже мастерам и ты же от всех. Понятно. Uh, he, he like uh, dominate and if there is a puppies, then he can uh, 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 organize and uh, discipline these puppies. Aha, aha. Yeah. Then, then he is a uh, puppy, uh, puppy owner uh, in, in it is his role. You must come to the international puppy uh contest here in the United States you must what in Hatim Hatim Paka Bridai what three quarter at the Paka by used in the Rhine Katauza put it uh up katana some uh procedure and river and mister for a sea what that ne put it proche was uh Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, he, he is very interested, but he thinks that uh, it it will take a couple of years, and he could arrange it. And uh, and of course, uh, they they are organizing uh, this competition of Mr. Lesser Russia a uh, couple of years, but uh, it, it it is uh, also very. In, in a very beginning, and uh, if this uh, event will be more developed and so on, and uh, um, then then probably they can uh, visit more other such kind of competitions, different uh, fetishes in uh, in other other countries, also in the United States. What kink do you most want to try? Ну, типа, всякие там игры, что такое, что это имеет в виду, да? Или это... Ну, короче, прежде всего, пускает сам мужик, как таковой, если он, ну, как бы сказать, ну, как бы подходит, что ли, если так можно сказать, не знаю. Ну, а там уже... <laughs> it's complicated uh, he, uh, he like if he could uh, meet uh, such real man uh, uh, a real masculine man uh, he he not he he don't um, don't tell any specific kink he'd like uh, to practice. Uh, uh. <laughs> My last question is, what is the biggest misconception about you? I don't know, maybe it's not a misconception, but no one can put it here, then I'm not. Вы, наверное, вот это недоразумение, хотя его можно назвать, но вот так. Uh, he thinks that the, the uh, mo uh, this most is so that uh, uh, most people didn't think he is a gay uh -huh. because uh, uh, he he how he act and how he look it, it uh, doesn't show any way that he could be a gay <laughs> that that is uh, the, the point lovely <laughs> but alexei i must say thank you very much Spasibo, for such a lovely interview ah ya hachu tadat parti pratibia za perevot за то, что ты такой хороший друг, который всегда помогает. Ну, спасибо нашему общему другу Джону Обраину. Ну, ты знаешь, который практически выбил э, да. друга на нас. Mm -hmm. И другу спасибо за внимание. Mm -hmm. 
Alexei uh, uh, told, uh, thank to me that I translated and also to John O'Brien who connected us. Absolutely. And also to you that you are interested about uh, uh, people in uh, Eastern Europe and especially about us. My pleasure. Это был очень приятно к нему. Взаимно. Да. Pleasure on both sides. Ah, yes. But, Mike, I must thank you very much as well. You were very kind to assist Alexei and me. This was very kind of you. And I say thank you very much. Yeah, you are welcome. You are welcome. I, I did my best. You did wonderfully. <laughs>